first night in the cockpit of this flight uh, Sevilla to Caire. I spent quite a long time at uh, altitude yesterday uh, to avoid first the turbulence, second to get good winds. Then I uh, slept the entire night at 12,000 feet, which is the limit. Well, we have to go. I spent too much time up there, I guess part of the job, uh, but a little bit less comfortable. I was cold also, tried to save weight before leaving and got rid of some stuff and, uh, and I was freezing. <laughs> so funny, the small things there. Normally I change shoes, now I kept the same. When I keep them too long, it they hurt. But I had to because uh, I, I was too cold with a, with a light one, which normally I wear through the night. So a little bit complaints uh, this morning. But extraordinary, uh, just to uh, spend, spend uh, the day, spend the night, now to start another day, to see the sunrise. Oh, that's, uh, that's fantastic. Preparing a small breakfast. so much in what I'm doing, I'm so present, I thought I would have a lot of flashbacks, not much yet, uh, just enjoy being here, and uh, I like to uh, discover how to go about you know, some difficulties and not to be upset by it take it as they are, take it as they come, uh, learning how to cope, looking a little bit how I uh, react, and uh, yeah, just uh, integrating them in my life. I think it's a, it's, it's, a bit, it's, 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 it's a superb training ground. So I hope I can apply this in normal life as well. See?